Bar is empty. Video. The Arkham Knight must have taken Oracle and moved on. I should examine the vehicle more closely. So, how do we do this part? It is all wide. The car veered off an empty road. Why? Looks like the driver wasn't wearing his seatbelt. I should find the body. Traces of pepper spray on the right side of the driver's face. Oracle must have been in the passenger seat and deliberately caused the crash. Clever. I should check the area where she was sitting. The door was torn off during the crash. If I can find where it came to rest, I can determine exactly what happened. Torn cleanly off the hinges, the door must have been opened before the crash. Oracle got out. I need to examine the reconstruction. Pinpoint where she landed. Oracle got free of the vehicle before the crash. Oracle stopped here. Someone took a shot at her. I should analyze the point of impact for ballistic evidence. The caliber of the weapon is a match for the Arkham Knight sidearm. The trajectory and impact velocity points to a shooter that matches his height. At this range, he couldn't have missed. A warning shot. <laughs> I've missed something. Oracle knew she couldn't escape, but she caused this crash for a reason. She must have left a clue while crawling away. How to do this? Mr. Way. Lucius, Oracle left me the scrambler device at the scene of the crash. Decrypt the data so I can pinpoint the Arkham Knight's location. Huh. This kind of thing was more Miss Gordon's specialty. I'll see what I can do, but it'll take me a little while. Oh, I'll meet okay. you at Wayne Tower when you're ready. Alfred, give me an update on Gotham's most wanted. One moment, sir. Right, these two are just in. A mysterious hooded figure has been spotted on a rooftop in Grand Avenue. He appears to be standing beside a burning bat symbol, sir. It might be wise to establish whether this interloper is friend or foe. Reports are also coming in of a blaze at the Bristol Fire Station. One suspects arson, sir, as the power to the building has been cut, disabling the fire suppression system. 
You may wish to investigate. How many side medicine do I have? Um. Hold on. I got a new thing that I can upgrade. Um, I will be, uh... Um... Um... I'm heading to Wayne Tower. If we can decrypt the Arkham Knight security protocols, we should be able to track his location. If he thinks he can hide from you, sir, he's in for something of a surprise. Say that it is good to be back. Gotham just wasn't the same without me, was it? I mean, Scarecrow's the biggest bad guy in town. <laughs> Not for long. Nice of you to drop in, Mr. Wayne. I suppose you weren't really dressed for the front entrance. Have you finished the decryption? Fully decoded. I've downloaded all recent militia radio transmissions and their corresponding coordinates to your machine. Thanks, Lucius. I can scan the network for the Arkham Knight's voice print and determine the location of his last broadcast. If I'd ever been curious about your identity, I would have torn off that mask years ago. I always figured the truth would be a letdown. But I have to admit, masquerading as Gotham's least interesting socialite is one hell of a cover story. The you had to go and spoil the, the surprise. I was hoping to keep her under wraps until she's ready. Next generation disruptor. She's still a couple of weeks from completion but I figured you'd appreciate a working prototype. I should have her with you later on this evening. Thanks, Lucius. I think I might need it. I've improved the frame too, of course. It's lighter and more durable than before.
Identity confirmed. Good evening, Mr. Wayne. Upload waveform for analysis. Now I've waited long enough. Batman dies. Tonight. Scanning communications for voice print match. Location verified. Got it. The night's transmitting from the Miyagani Tunnel Network. Glad to be of assistance, Mr. Wayne. While you're here, we've been working on some further upgrades for your car. Let me know where you'd like us to focus our efforts. An upgrade to your weapons generator will let you overcharge the Batmobile's secondary weapons. You'll be a force to be reckoned with. Excellent choice. I'll prepare it right away. Now if there's anything else you need, I'll be here all night. It's not like I could leave this city even if I wanted to. Take care, Mr. Wayne. You know where to find me. Alfred, I've traced the Arkham Knight to the Miyagani Tunnel System. Excellent news, sir. But I'm detecting a significant drone presence in the area. It would be folly to engage them without the Batmobile. Noted. Shall I open the south entrance? Hold off until I get there, Alfred. I don't want to spoil the surprise. I'm telling you we should split. What happens if the Bat decides to break all our limbs? We just trashed the emergency room. I don't want to find out what Scarecrow's got planned next. Stay within range of the remote control. Like a bull. I need to stay within range of the remote control. Stay within range of the remote control.
Alfred, I'm at the tunnel entrance. Open the doors. Just a moment, sir. I'm accessing the building's security mainframe. Alfred, there's another blast door. I need you to open it. Oh dear. It seems they've locked me out of the system. They must know you're here. Don't worry, Alfred. I'll find another way in. I need to find a way to get that tunnel entrance open. Progress on the cure. Getting there. Hey, I haven't heard from Barbara for a while. Is she okay? She's fine. She's working on something for me. It's important. But she's safe, right? Don't worry, Tim. Just keep working on that cure. See why you didn't tell him after old Jimbo's hysterical overreaction. Still, if you cared about Barbara the way that little sidekick of yours does, maybe she wouldn't have got kidnapped in the first place. Be it you. Shame they're being torn apart thanks to your crusade. Barbara's kidnapped, and let's face it, probably dead. You're lying to love a boy wonder about it, and dear old Jim's marched off on his lonesome to save the day. Not your best day at the office, Bat. <laughs> Something on your mind? out of his cage. Force him to slave over your cure. Plus, if he gets himself killed out there, you won't have to tell him about Barbara. <laughs> it's win-win! You think he's really gonna fix your nasty case of jokeritis? <laughs> Not a chance. I'm chronic, Brucey. I'm lingering. We both know there's no cure for me. Can you remember when it was simple? Back in the old days when it was just you, me, a regular war against crime. Well, take a look, Bat. Things change. Now it's just war, with you standing right bang in the center. Of course, like with any war, there are casualties. It's inevitable, unavoidable. Like death. Well, maybe not death. I seem to have sidestepped that one. <laughs> Still, not all of us are so lucky. Remember Talia? 
course you do. How could you forget a girl like that? All it took was one piece of lead to end your hopes of a happily ever after. <laughs> you blamed me, of course, but you were wrong. What? You put her in my crosshairs, Bats. Sure, she didn't do herself any favors, but it was you. You see, people trust you. They believe in you. They follow you into your war, and you... You are about to get them all killed!
come on. I can't fight them without the car. Too risky. That's about to do, so I'm just gonna leave it for here. I hope you saw it, make sure you like, subscribe, answer. I saw this.